After a long wait, Apple has finally rolled out the macro Sequoia 15.1 beta with the Apple Intelligence. Jumped by the power of Apple Intelligence, many have rushed to download the macOS 15.1 developer beta. Unfortunately, many users have reported that the macOS 15.1 developer beta is not showing up on their Macs. If you have also run into the same problem, I have got you covered with quick fixes. That's it, let's get started. Bear in mind that Apple Intelligence requires the A17 Pro and higher an Apple M series chip. That means if you don't have a Mac with an Apple Silicon chip, you won't get this feature. So keep this important thing in your mind. Many a time you can fix the macOS beta related issues by just force quitting the system settings app. Just click on the Apple menu on the top and then choose force quit option. Then select the system settings app in the menu and then click on the force quit button. After that you have to restart your Mac. And once your Mac has restarted, head over to the software update section to find out if the macOS 15.1 beta has appeared. If the macOS 15.1 beta is still not showing up on your Mac, I would recommend you to sign in at Apple Developer Program website. To do so, open a browser and then go to Apple Developer Program website. After that, you have to sign in using your Apple ID and password. And then you have to restart your Mac. And once your Mac has rebooted, go to the software update section to check if the Mac OS 15.1 beta has started to show up. If it has, go ahead to download and install the beta, just like any other update. And that's about it. So these are the best tips and tricks to fix Mac OS Sequoia 15.1 developer beta, not showing a problem on your Mac. Hopefully you have gotten the better at the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like, consider it, and I'll see you in the next video with most attendee macro tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and happy. Bye bye.